What is up you guys? Hope you guys are having a great day. Today I have got Charlie with me and we are going to be doing a little 1v1 competition. Now this is going to be something that we have never done before. If you have been along on any of my videos, you might have seen some of my shorts where I pick stuff up along the river, you will know that I have found a lot of random lures that people just leave behind. So I'll show you what we, what I have found recently. So we've got a little black and blue crack and craw found it in the sand. I found what appears to be a little Ozark Trail popper. I have no idea what these are. Um, they're little like goldfish lures with like balls on their tail. Uh, we've got a Guggenbaits Slim Shake Worm in the natural color there. And then we have got this little jig. So Charlie and I are gonna be going back and forth choosing which kind of lure we want to fish with. And Charlie, how should we how should we grade this? Whoever catches the biggest, I'd say whoever manages to catch the biggest fish on their picked lures is going to be the winner of our challenge. Yeah. How does that sound? That sounds good. good. Okay, so Charlie, since you're the guest, I will let you pick out the first bait. Um, I'm going to pick the marabou jig. You're going to pick the marabou jig? Mm -hmm. Why is that? Um, It looks very lively, and I feel like it will do well in summer water. Mm-hmm. Fair, fair. I think I'm gonna go with the Slim Shake Worm and I'll go again since um, since Charlie picked first. So I'll go with that and I'm gonna go with the Crack and Craw. And I'd say since there's two of these, we'll both go with them, right? Mm -hmm. I'll take one and you take one. Yeah. Which leaves Charlie the popper. Yep. How do you feel about that? Yeah, fine. Feels fair. Alright guys, stay tuned. So Charlie is starting off with his little jig and I have got that Guggenbaits Slim Shake Slim Shake Worm on. Oh, there's a fish. On that slim shake worm. It's got bugs in my ear. That grass carp. Big boy. Did you get a fish? That's a fish. Nice. All right, guys, this is crazy. All right, guys, this is crazy. But on my first cast, I got a uh, fish right away on the Guggenbait Slim Shake Worm. I'm going to get a measurement. And then send him off. Charlie is getting a fish, reeling a fish right now on his jig. 11, 11 inches. inches. Okay, Charlie's got his bass here. She got on his little jig. It's 11 inches and mine was just 12 inches. So why don't you go ahead and pop him off, Charlie? The Guggen Slim Shake Worm. Charlie, here, why don't you... you can choose between the Polywog or this Popper. What do you think? Can I stick with the bait I have? Nope. No. Nope. nope. Can't stick with the bait you have. I'll go with the polywag. Okay. So Charlie has got the little polywag on. And I've got my little crack and craw on. So I'm in the lead by an inch. I've got 12 inches and Charlie's got 11 inches. That was a blow up. Did you see that? That was crazy. That's a fish on. Good 
You get the measure? Yep. Charlie just got his second bass and he got his on the polywog. I think Charlie might be the first one to complete the challenge. Oh my goodness. I just fell into a hole of mud. Oh no. Balls. You able to get it out, Charlie? Yep. Guys, please like and subscribe so I can afford some new shoes. Yikes. Charlie? Nice little bass. Yep. Got the measurement on him. So, Charlie's bass just beat my previous by half an inch. For 12 and a half inches, my previous one was 12. So, I'm going to have to pick it up and try to catch a bigger... F and have to, I'll have to catch a bigger bass, which doing top water I think shouldn't be too hard. He went for it a second time. Oh, a third time! Oh! oh. Doubled up again. Oh my goodness. If I just toss it out there, I bet he'll come for it. That was crazy! That guy was determined! Oh, that's a big one. Well, decent size. I think that's another dink, Charlie. Does that count? Does yeah. that put me down? Yeah, that's your last fish. What? Bring him in. Bring him. That's unlucky. Yeah, so for Charlie's last fish, he caught a little dink. I have got eight inches on nice. this bass. So do you want to let him go? Yeah. Well. Congratulations to Charlie, who won with the biggest fish. He caught a fish on all three of the lures before I could, so we stopped the challenge, and Charlie's biggest fish was at 12 and a half inches, and mine was at 12 inches. So, what do you have to say, Charlie? What, um, what contributed to the success? The water, and like very warm. It's not like too cold. All right, so make sure you guys like and subscribe for more challenges like this one.